What's up guys and welcome to Ratchet and Clank on the PlayStation 4. I can't even get to explaining how excited I am for this game, my most anticipated game of 2016. You guys know that I love the Ratchet and Clank series because we've let's played seven different Ratchet and Clank games here on the channel and I'm so happy to make this the eighth. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited for this, the new movie coming up soon. I hope you guys are too. If you are excited, let me know in the comments section below. Give this video a like. Do everything you need to do to let me know you'd like to see more. But for now, let's hop in to Ratchet and Clank. We know who this is. Greetings, new fish. I'm Captain Quark. I I don't believe it. You're here. I used to dream of being arrested by you. Now get out of here. I was talking to you, Zed. Yes, Captain. So, new fish, I take it you followed my many, many adventures? Of course I have. You're the most famous superhero in the galaxy. He ain't famous anymore! <laughs> Words hurt, Solitary Bill. I'm a huge fan. I even pre-ordered the new Ratchet & Clank Hollow game. The what? You know, the game based on that incident with you and that Lombax. Oh, you must mean the Hollow film. Yeah, it's pretty good. If you like all CG. No, I mean the game. It's based on the Hollow film. Look, here's my confirmation email. I'm having it mag shipped to prison. <laughs> They're making a game based on a holo film based on my life? But they haven't even consulted me! Oh, this is my fault. I've been away from my adoring public in this forsaken place too long. And now, no one will ever hear my side. I'd like to hear your side, Captain. You would? Well, then sit down, wary criminal, and I'll tell you a story. It all started with a hapless Lombax named Ratchet. Wow, that's a really interesting way to start it. I wasn't really expecting that. That was cool. Ooh, what's going on now? There he is. Uh-oh, whoa, oh, oh, whoa. Oh. Where do you think you're going? Hey, Grim, you're here. I... I thought you'd be down at the bazaar shopping for gravity coils. Uh-huh. Well, I'm here. I'm always here. I don't suppose you sneaking out would have anything to do with those Galactic Ranger tryouts? I just need one hour. Come on, Grim. These are the Galactic Rangers we're talking about. Captain Quark will be there. No leaving the garage until you help fix Mr. Micron's ship. Now get on that bolt crank! Well... That's a new character. So it looks Does like that ship look mag lifted to you. Get on that bolt crank. Come on. So is Ratchet an apprentice? Okay, wait, wait, wait. Look at this. This game is beautiful. Oh my Come gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay, okay. Okay, Mr. What was your name? Avionics fried. CPU fried. Even the gosh darn gravity coils fried. Oh, you really did a number. Okay, let's see if these new Versa bulbs work. Jeez, I'm just trying to take this in. You see something flashing? All right, yeah. so we gotta. Left side looks good. All right, so we're doing the left to right. The afterburner light. Well, the left afterburner light checks out. We're just learning how to like use the camera and stuff. <laughs> I'm gonna let the game talk, but I also want to, you know, also put in my piece. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited for this. Tryouts are being held at the fairgrounds. Show him what you got, kid. All uh, right, thanks, man. 
We're going? Oh, whoa. And his adventure, hoping to become a galactic ranger. Hooray! <laughs> whoa. This game is so beautiful. As somebody who, you know, played the original Ratchet and Clank way back when, like when I was still a kid, like you can see where this was all inspired, but you can see the pieces of the original game mixed in with this highly detailed, just beautiful stuff going on. This it's been like two minutes. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is crazy. All right, I'm gonna have a lot of fun playing through this with you guys. I hope you guys do enjoy it. All right, whoa, am I going the right way? I don't think I am I already finding secret stuff. Ah, oh, these things. Okay, boom. And it controls just like a future game. So, so far, so good. All right. Sorry, Quark's talk, Quark talks too much, so we're gonna have to talk over him from time to time. But um, let's keep going. Wow, when are we gonna get our first weapon? When are we gonna run into stuff? So we're going to try for the Galactic Rangers as new characters. Like, Ratchet seems to be like an apprentice of some sorts, which is odd, because obviously he was sort of like, in, no, I wouldn't say, I guess sort of orphaned. Oh, that's a Grav Butarian. Definitely not getting up there. <laughs> okay, let's not have the first death, but man. And like the animations are on point. <laughs> in order to best his foes, Ratchet used the warrior's time-honored tradition of jumping. Hooray, jumping. <laughs> But oh my gosh, so it does revamp Ratchet 1, of course, with the, you know, leveled up weapons and experience. Face mortal peril. Should he find himself on the verge of death, he'd need to find nanotech to heal. Oh, uh, I used that stuff after a bank robbery once. It healed, like, three out of five gunshot wounds. <laughs> And you can even see there's these small bits of level design like this was like, you know, this is like jump for jump out of the original game. And as somebody who grew that, you know, play, like I said, played that growing up, I've played it here on the channel back in like 2010. It was one of my first ever Let's Plays. So it's just crazy, crazy stuff. Just to be able to see it in a new life. Flagrant disregard for public property. Look at him smashing crates. <laughs> the hubris. <laughs> Maybe he was just saving up bombs so we could buy a new weapon to protect the galaxy with. Basically, yep. Who's telling the story here? Hey, it's me. I'm the one playing. I'm the one telling the story. I right, always over there. We did miss a few things, but it looks like we do have quite a lot. If you see in the hub there next to the bush, looks like there's some other type of currency. I'm not sure if we're gonna have like level ups with that. There's a lot to dive into. I'm not sure if I'm gonna be getting all the secret like. 100% stuff, but I figure I'll try for it. The more you guys, you know, are interested in support this, the more I'll be interested in trying, you know, more in-depth stuff out like that. But for right now, we're just enjoying the game normally. Wow. I can't stop looking at it. Oh, this guy's familiar. <laughs> All right, we'll go and check him out. Look at this, we got like a little crowd going on too. Hey, guys. All right. I'm right, just trying to get every bolt I can, because if it's any, it's, if it's like any of the other Ratchet and Clank games, it's going to be a bit of a grind for some of them. All right, what's going on, dude? Can I talk to you? Oh, nope, but I can beat you up. <laughs> All right, let's, is this a race? I don't know what this is supposed to be. Like, it's like, probably like a obstacle course of some sort or something. Here we go. Cora Verilux here. Show us how quick you can be on your feet by jumping over these obstacles. All right, we're doing good so far. Now keep moving to the next part of the course. Oh, this is so cool. I, this makes me so happy. Whoa. Just always mindful of their surroundings. Hop across these moving platforms. All right, whoa, whoa, whoa. This is actually a little tricky. <laughs> okay, there you go. You could be the recruit we've been looking for. Keep moving to the next part of the course. We can't, we haven't really done too much. All right, whoa, and those are the, they're not the tachyons, but these are the guys that you see more, you know, definitively in the future series. So that's interesting. It's great how it retells them. My specialty is brute force. Let's see how well you can bash these crates. Oh, cra you know, smashing crates is our thing. Moving, it's time to get our hands on some firepower. All right, I'll take it. Grab a fusion grenade glove from this Gadgetron vendor. Ooh, all right, let's get our first, oh, and is, oh, it costs 100. Well, that's not really fine. I mean, that's real, not that much of an issue. Um, and we can also buy full health and ammo, so that's good to see. Next step, blow stuff up. All right, let's go for it, boom. <laughs> awesome. All right, cool, 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 whoa. All right, we just got little bad guys again. We can deal with them. <laughs> Solana Galaxy is a perilous place, as evidenced by the large amounts of ammunition left sitting around in crates. All right, and I, I was worried if I was gonna be overcritical with this game, because of course I've played all the other ones very endearingly, but so far I'm incredibly impressed. Please do not run up and keep on shaking hands. My mighty vice like grip has been known to shake the confidence of even the most heroic of men. All right, if you say so. 
Uh, what is over here? There is a little secret area over here just with some bolts. Ooh, and what is this? Whoa, a holo card. Sweet. Nice. What is a holo card? Let's press the options to view. What is this? Um, a holo card. Now here, you've just collected your first holo card. Ooh. You can earn single holo cards by defeating enemies. Nice. Or you can explore secret areas to find packs of three. Your goal is to complete a whole set of holo cards. Oh really? This is new. Wow. Ooh. So whoa, we got some stuff there. So is this like a trading card game? Tried in five duplicate cards. Oh, this is interesting. So right now we have like a Grimm's Workshop, a Ratchet. Okay. Interesting. So these look like they're collectibles. They don't seem to have like any like trading card or like you know a battling card game kind of thing to them. Very weird, but also very cool. I think that's the way we actually unlock sort of hidden stuff. I'm not really sure too much about it, but that is so cool. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Whoa, what was that? Okay, it's a bad guy. Ow. We've armed these dummies with Gadgetron flamethrowers. Our lawyers are totally cool. Really? I'm a little surprised by that. You may just be the next Galactic Ranger. Head to the final challenge. Oh boy, here we go. You can do this. Yes, you can. This is awesome so far. It's time for the final challenge. Survive a brutal onslaught of enemies, and you just might be our next Galactic Ranger. All right, let's go for it. And oh, maybe an intern. Can we go through? Whoa, oh, here they are. Boom. One down. How many are we gonna have to fight? I'm guessing a lot. Ooh, they do drop a good amount of bolts. We've already made our first 1,000. <laughs> Wonder how many thousands upon thousands we're gonna make from here on out. Probably a lot. But I can't wait to see some of the other levels. Of course, I have seen gameplay, and it's just like, oh, It's just good crazy. You know, it's like we've been waiting so long for this ratchet level up to defeat enemies to increase your maximum health. I'll take it. So we just got 20 on the 20 health. Cool. All right, so we'll keep doing that. Make sure we get more levels. Are you looking at Solana's next Galactic Ranger? Possibly. Ooh, I would like it. I would like it. I'd sign up for that. All right, let's actually start. Now, I gotta remember to strafe. Because, geez, if there's one thing I always forget to do in this game, it's strafe. And you guys always let me know. <laughs> all right, cool. That wasn't so bad. Yeah, that wasn't really that bad at all. All right, so yeah, this is how you strafe. Just, just as, as you would any other Ratchet game. Cool. Ladies and gentlemen, the savior of Solana, Captain Quark. Hello, Veldin! Hello, Captain! He's on fire again. I know. My name is Copernicus Quark, and yes, that was an impressive wall of fire I just walked past. I'm gonna be real with you folks for a moment. When President Vironix recommended I take on a new ranger, I knew just where to go. That's right. We want you! I know what you're thinking. Do I have what it takes? After all, you may not have prevented Dr. Nefarious from atomizing Illyro City. You may not have stopped Neftin Prague from rendering the entire population of Aridia colorblind. Twice. After all, you may not have this chiseled jaw or godlike pectoral region, but if you have heart, then you have what it takes. You don't have what it takes. Aww. But I have heart. Yes, but unfortunately that heart is encased in a weak, muscleless mass of inexperience. Plus there's your history to consider. Got a long line of citations here. Possession of an illegal gravity repulsor. Operation of a black market accelerator. Willful disruption of the space-time continuum. That is a funny story. You're reckless. You're a loose cannon and you're dangerous. That's my shtick. Wait, God. Just give me a chance. All right, no time. Galaxy in jeopardy. Get back out there. And remember, you can do anything. As long as you're me. Next! Meanwhile, on planet Quartu... Dr. Nefarious, the mad scientist who made all of this possible. Mad suggests cognitive impairment. I'm more of a vengeful scientist. I trust you're here Whoa. to meet the troops. <laughs> <laughs> State your prime objective. Destroy Galactic Rangers. State your prime objective. Destroy Galactic Rangers. State your prime up. Hmm. Hello. Defect detected. Preparing for immediate destruction. In three. Oh no. Two. Oh, a defect. Go play, Victor. 
Oh no. Well, this isn't good. So now what's going on? Defect knew that his best chance for survival lay with the facility's ventilation system. If he could just run to the vent, he might just make it out of there alive. Oh boy. Let's go for it. Escape the factory. And now we're playing as Clank. Oh, nice. But you can see they had pre-robot nefarious in there, which is super interesting. I like that. All right, so I guess Victor, whoever that was, is going to chase us. You never disappoint. Oh, no. But of course, this is a new voice for that dude. I forget his name. But it's cool to see that they even uh, referenced Neft in there, which is cool. If he were to survive, he would have to throw a bomb at whatever lay in his path. Oh. Oh, look at this guy. Oh, you're a cutie. Wee! <laughs> that is awesome. I love that. He could now defeat the deadliest of forces gravity. The hopeless defect had to throw a spring bot. But where? I'm how? Just like that? Okay. This is awesome. So Clank really seems to be beefed up in this game to actually be more of a playable character than ever, which I love a lot. I right, just throw that over there because even Clank stations have existed in other Ratchet games ever since the first one, but sometimes it'd be a little weak, so I'm glad to see this is already pretty cool. Let's keep going. And I just, this is the most gorgeous game I've ever played. Whoa, 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 okay, okay, big guy. Whoa, okay, ah, uh, no. <laughs> oh, jeez, ouch, okay, that hurt. Um, whoa. Running, you useless piece of scrap. You know, for being such a big dude, he does run pretty darn slow. Okay, come on, go, 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 go. Oh, no, run, oh, and, oh, I thought we were able to get a, make a smooth getaway there, but not quite, come on. Oh, please don't, please don't. Oh, no. <laughs> But I think that was actually a clip from the movie that we saw earlier, so one thing I hope it's fine for copyright grounds, but another thing that's really interesting that they would just straight up include a piece of the movie. I mean, I guess it, you know it's good for a storytelling perspective, but at the same time, just really odd. Okay, here, here you go. Uh, that didn't really work. Oh, I could throw it over here though. Boom. All right, and we're out of here. Nice. All right, now what's going on here? Spotted a power bot. This device could power up a variety of machines, but where should he throw it? <laughs> You're like really good at adding drama, man. <laughs> Thank you, Shiv. I pride myself on my pension for storytelling. I love how the game already has its sense of humor that it's always had. All right, throw that over there, right? No, 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 we'll probably have to throw that on whatever the heck this thing is. All right, there you go. It electrocuted it, hooray! Now we got more of it. Now we're gonna have to combo stuff up. One thing I liked, my favorite Ratchet or Clank sections, ooh. Look at that! Ah, no! Oh no, my butt! Oh, first death. <laughs> Whoops! <laughs> Can I respawn or am I stuck? Oh no! Oh, okay. All right, so we're gonna move on from here, just because I don't think we can get that bull yet. Maybe one day. That day is just not today. All right, let's get all this and let's keep going. What is this here? Huh? Let's punch it! Boom! Oh, that's gonna change something up. Ah, okay, that's much easier. Well, I just went out of my way for nothing. Oh, it, it happens, it happens. All right, I love that down slam he has. Like, that's just like super boom. It just carries so much weight, I love it. All right, go over here, and then I'm gonna toss it. I just can't believe I'm playing this game right now. This is awesome. All right, <laughs> and now we're here. Okay, ooh, it's a lava tube. And just, oh, okay, we're going through the same thing again here. I'm running, okay, oh boy. And just already, it's been pretty darn cool. I mean, we're only 20 minutes in here at the most, but, oh man, this has been a lot of fun. Whoa, slide down, slide down. Come on, oh, you're not even sliding. You're just gonna run on down. Taking the boring way out. I'm getting hit by everything now. You miserable defect. Jeez, you don't have to be so rude about it. All right, whoa, okay. I didn't da get damaged there though, that's good. Ooh, no, <laughs> okay. He's really bad at his job though, I'll tell him that much. I'll try. I don't know what I'm trying to outrun right now. Whoa. Whoa, okay, okay. Getting a little more crazy here. <laughs> hold on, hold on. Apply, sprocket by sprocket. Calm it down. Oh. <laughs> this is really ridiculous. He's starting to get closer and we don't have much room to run here. Oh no. Uh oh, he caught me. <laughs> oh no. All right, now we're making our way a little bit farther. Come on, jump over that. Keep going, keep going. We're not gonna let him get us. Oh, and it's the same thing as last time, a bunch of water. All right, I'm just going through here. So this is sort of rinse and repeat so far, pun intended. Oh, oh my.
Oh, no, no. Go, go! Oh. Computer. Set coordinates for the Galactic Ranger home base. Destination set. We will never make it. But hey, what are you gonna do? <laughs> oh, dear. So there we go, that was an awesome first episode of Ratchet and Clank. I'm loving the game so much and I hope you guys are too. But what's gonna happen is Ratchet going to find a new way to get into that Galactic Alliance or whatever it was and is Clank going to be able to get out of there without a crash landing of some sorts. Guess we'll find out in episode two, but either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the first episode. If you did, make sure to give it a like, share it with your friends and family, and of course, comment in the comment section below. If you watched this part of the video, make sure you comment Zebra Ratchet so I know you've watched the end of the video and that you're a Zebra-tastic viewer. But either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.